What's going on everyone? Boss here again. This time we're here for Demon Slayer, Queen of Yaiba, the Sorceress Village Arc, Episode 2. Well, uh, last time we had a very long episode uh, for, you know, the, the premiere of the season and we see, you know, we, we saw the upper moons, um, all of them, um, and moves on. So we got a good idea of, you know, the personalities and what they look like. And there seems to be um, Kyoko and um, the Hantengu or something like that. They're used to are looking into something um, that they can use to help Muzan. So we'll see what they're doing. And also, we got Tanjiro that he recovered after two months after the last battle. And um, he's had, he's at the Swordsmith, Swordsmith Village now. Um, <laughs> waiting for his sword, uh, his sword meant to come back because he's missing. So, all that going on, um, we left off seeing the Miss Hashira, and then we saw the guy that Chandra saw in his dreams. So, big cliffhanger, and um, we're back. So, without further ado, let's jump in. He has the earrings, but look at his face. And then his arms. He's like, I don't know what to... Ooh, dang! He knocked him out. Dang! He said the voice is annoying. Yeah, you can't, you can't take hands off of him. Ooh! Quit the violence. And he's he's going to open the box? Oh! Yo, hands off, bro. This ain't yours. Yo, he's like, yo, did you just slap my hand away? Oh, and he took the kid, too. He's a matter of fact, bro. <laughs> See, lies by making swords. Yeah, Tanjo not gonna like him. <laughs> Tanjo said, no! Yo, Tanjo not, not liking you? Oh, there's people in the background. Oh. Tanjo giving speeches. Ah, he said all the time for the speech. Oh. <laughs> Yo. He said I'm going to end the speech right here. Oh, he left. He smell you, though. Oh, he's lying. <laughs> Tanjo can... Oh, I thought he could tell when people are lying. Oh, Nezuko doing when he was knocked out. <laughs> She's like, damn, I'm not moving. It's a doll. There you go. Dang, a superpower doll. Oh, we got six arms with the... That's good practice. Yoichi type zero. Dang, so the guy it was made after was so good that you need six arms to match. Yeah, he was, he was a minute ago. <laughs> so that dream you saw was 300 years ago. Dang. Oh, so there was no knowledge. Oh, the crow? The crow just dropped some crazy knowledge just now. <laughs> and apparently a fan. So he's a descendant of a fire breather. The first fire breathing. A fire breather. <laughs> Sound like a dragon. Yo, this crow's aggressive, man. <laughs> Yo, he made him doubt himself. Inherited memory, ah. But don't they say he has the same earring as the guy? Kotetsu. 
Oh, that's it? He's I, I can smell you. <laughs> but, oh, he said it again, though. He mentioned the last episode. His sense of spell is kind of off. He flicked him. <laughs> he got up there easily, too. I was like, yeah, even if you can't do it, somebody else is probably going to do it. I was like, yo, I might not kill him, but somebody will. <laughs> the smoke don't stop. Maybe Tantra can learn something from watching, too. You done? <laughs> he forgot who he was. Yo, he took his sword. Oh, wow, the crow. Oh, it functions. You just have five arms now. <laughs> Rage. Train and just defeat the Miss Hashira. <laughs> Dang. Oh, the thunder. Time to train. Oh, we got clubs. Oh, this is a remix from a song they used to have. I remember from the first season. Yo, <laughs> this kid is, is a different level. Oh, he's younger than Tanjiro. Ooh. <laughs> he said, You're pathetic. Yo, this kid is chewing him out. He's his boss also. He's his coach. His manager. Ooh, his face let him cross the ground. You gonna have swords now? Ooh, this power though. He's actually listening to him too. Yo, look at him. <laughs> Yo, drinking rainwater? Without sleeping water? Dang. <laughs> Yo, is he going to see his siblings? <laughs> Can you imagine the show just ended like this? He just died of hunger. Yo, this man is actually going through a near-death experience. Oh, that's what he needed. The near-death experience. Oh. Ungraceful, but hey. Hey, food. Oh, he's getting it. Yeah, stamina helps too. And then he found something, so. Like prediction sent. Ooh, nice dodge. Oh, you're not gonna break it? Then all that in the middle of the strike? Ooh, got a little haircut, a little trim. Oh, his sword broke? Okay. Decapitated. Oh, there's a hidden... Oh. A hidden sword. <laughs> Not a sword in the stone, it's a sword in a doll. Three hundred year old sword? Hey, sound like a promise sword to me. Are we in the ending now? First time, right? Is Mitsuri focus? Seems like it. <laughs> Her crow has the wrap. Oh. 
So they gotta get their eyes, their vision blocked too to go to the village. Yeah, Tokito looks way different. His demeanor is way different than it is now in his youth or further youth. I like the visuals, but of course the visuals are always good. Oh, look at Nezuko. All right, that was episode two of the season of Demon Slayer. We see, uh, we kind of entered some training. Uh, we got, uh, we saw Tokito um, training with the doll that we found out it was a doll. It wasn't the guy that we saw in Tanjiro's dream, um, which the dream turned out to be 300 years from 300 years ago. So we see that guy, um, you know, the doll that he was modeled, that was modeled after him, but it needed six arms to even be at his level. So that gives you, you know, <laughs> that shows you how strong he was. And then, um, so Tokito, he's, he's way powerful, more powerful than Tantra at this point, even though Tantra said he was younger than him. And, uh, we found out that he's a descendant from the first sun breathing, um, people. Uh, so that's more hype and more lore for him. And we still got his personality. <laughs> He's kind of straightforward. He, he doesn't mean to be mean on purpose. It's just how he is. But even Tantra's like, yo, I don't like you. <laughs> Which is rare for Tantra because you know Tantra's such a good boy. But yeah, uh, Tantra trained. He he found out, you know, he had his opening thread that he can sense. But now he found something else that he said he can get to quicker than that. Um, which seems like he's kind of like predicting where the attacks are going to go. So... He's adapting, he's growing, he's getting stronger. Um, his training was needed. I mean, of course, there's always training is necessary, especially in the shonen. But, you know, as you progress through, the, the villains get stronger and stronger. Um, but yeah, cool episode. We got some more from the Mishashira, some Tanjo training. And then there's a sword uh, from 300 years ago. So the magical sword, <laughs> Excalibur. <laughs> um, but yeah, I enjoyed this week's episode. And now it's going to be a long week. Long wait till next week, but gotta do what I gotta do. <laughs> so, until then.